Before we begin season four, we gotta watch this Shiro Tozori's Shiro the Shiro Torizawa ending cut. Oh, he speaks. The monster himself. Oh, these are his parting words. Everything he says is so meaningful. This is... This is really, like, showing his love. For someone like him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He really knows them. For someone so focused to take this time, to give them this really high-level wisdom and advice. And they know it. Wow. What an honor. Huh. Right, their, their punishment, discipline to the end. Well, it wasn't crying into noodles, but it was still touching in its way. Only Ushiwaka could pull that off, or he's that stoic, but still manages to be that touching. I mean, to them, he's a god, right? And Like, God took the time out of his life and day to show them that he knows them cares about them, believes in them, and wants them to succeed. Good man. Makes me like him even more. And, you know, you don't really, or I don't really feel bad for him, because while it would have been nice for him to win his senior year, I know that's significant to a lot of people. Not only does he have tons of championships under his belt already, but this is just the beginning of his career. He's going to go on to do great things, clearly. A lot of you guys pointed out that his challenge to Hinata and Kageyama was an honor, because it's his last year, so him saying that he'll see them again means he expects them to join him in the upper ranks. He's a classy guy. But now he's gone, because it's time for... Nationals. Winners stay on the court for one more. Better recognize. Better be legends. And Tanaka better get a girlfriend. If that Slytherin kid in the OVA can get a girlfriend, Tanaka can't be too far behind. Because as we all know, the most important factor in having a sexy girlfriend is being clutch at volleyball. And there's no other criteria. Oh, this is like before the scene we saw? Steep wager. We defeated it? Now I understand the true significance of those two OVAs. It wasn't about the Nationals, it was about Hinata defeating a boar. And the opening! Picking himself up off the floor. Ah, there you go, lights came on. Yeah, I see the Japan flag. It's a big deal. It's just hitting me what Nationals means. Are we gonna do some garbage cleanup like my my academia? Is that our training? You're still there? I thought you were. This coach is still around. Ushiwaka is still looming large. Damn, Asahi looks like he grew up like 20 years. Daichi too. Oh yeah, the animation, the animators changed, right? Still looks great so far. Episode one introductions. You're welcome. <laughs> oh, he's getting kind of nervous. Yeah, one thing the last episode of season 3 established is how hard they're all pitching in, despite having, you know, lives. And then Kagayama goes to the youth league or whatever, youth training. Can make all the difference. Yeah. It is kind of true. Generally speaking, the taller you are, the less you think about people's height. Oh, he's taller than me. I want to do this. I want to try. I'm curious. Though I'm probably nowhere near what I was at my peak. I managed to dunk. Once. <laughs> Once in my life. It was glorious. Definitely couldn't do it now. A lot of them are, yeah, they're, I mean, they all probably could dunk, or a lot of them could. I don't know why I'm so obsessed with dunking. Does volleyball and basketball happen in the same same season, same time? If not, it would be great at basketball. <laughs> Kageyama just beats him out. Kageyama <laughs> Time for the big news. All Japan Youth Training Camp. But this doesn't take him away from his from the team duties, right? So this is a win for everyone, no? Wow, that's really cool. Yeah, what an honor. Nice! 
牛若は最終的な代表まで残ってたわけで王様がそこまで残れるかは分かんないわけで。日本中の15、16歳の選手たちの中から一握りの有望株が招集される。Yeah, this is really a huge, it's an amazing opportunity. 合宿は12月頭の5日間で、1月の春高直前になりますので、強制ではありません。Ah, <笑>、uh, you gotta go, man. Yeah, you gotta go. Everyone will support him going. No question. And they'll come back and play the nationals. It'll be even better. 俺たちの性質上、今さら守りに入ってもしょうがない。We have so clearly established that. <laughs> you go for it with everything you got. What, what about you? <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, I don't know. 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 Nothing to do with you, or nothing to do with who you want to be, more importantly. I never thought Onishinoya is immature. He's playful, but I mean, he's super mature. They're really going above and beyond this valuable community. You get a training camp, and you get a training camp. Oh, but the seniors don't get a training camp. Tsuki. Yeah, I knew it. After the way he played. Plus, he's, he's six foot. <laughs> it's 190 centimeters. What about you? Poor Inada, though. He wants it so bad. You know what? Use it. Win nationals. You gotta go, dude. You gotta go. I mean, just considering how much he learned from that experience, that, that training camp, you gotta go. Who knows what he's capable of? What the upper limit is? Don't rub it in. Come on, dude. Oh, that was painful. I didn't like that. I'm gonna let the demons win there a little. Oh, this is really turning into something painful. Ah. Oh, poor kid. He gave everything. He gave his, his all. He crushed it. He's still not being recognized. Even the strongest people, man, they're gonna have moments. Even someone as strong and optimistic as Hinata, it's gonna sting. You know, like you really believe that the world rewards you for doing well, or you want to believe. But it won't break him. He's such a good kid. Like, I, I don't know. I want to see him get the acknowledgement he deserves. Someone. I wonder how he's going to settle in with new teammates. Come on, guys. You gotta use your intuition a little bit here. Is he visiting Shira Torizawa? Familiar faces. Still bitter. Salty. Oh, no. He just showed up. He just showed up. Oh my god, he just went ahead with it. That's so amazing. Nothing gets this kid down. I see we've lost the bottle mid cards for good. Make your case. Make your case. Eat it. Eat the embarrassment and just go for it. And the coach might coach might do it. And I broke. He's talking to him. I love it. <laughs> he did. I, like, I don't know. If the coach is, is open minded enough and has certain priorities and just really wants the kids to get better, if he has a personality halfway resembling someone like Nakoma's coach, there's no massive downside or danger to it or unfairness, then good chance. There are some cases where just making a direct appeal and going through the normal processes will get you what you want. It's, it's so rare. And if people actually are looking for initiative and drive, or you simply understand what it is they're looking for and make the case that you can provide it, things have a way of working out. The processes are there to streamline 
whatever the goal is, but the goal is still the goal at the end of the day. I got into university without my SAT and without even applying because I found the dean and made a case for myself and made a vow that I would make honors, which I did. <laughs> Gotta admire it though. I like to cut it <laughs> I don't know. Is, is, is it just me? Am I alone? Am I crazy? Make your case, Nada. Make your case. Ah, he's one of those. He's one of them. He sees it. Maybe it's a cultural thing. Oh my god. Yo, this dude, he, so much growth. That was so big of him. I, oh my god, I love it. Of all people, Sakusaki the legendary Itachiyama. Yeah, I don't know that much about them. Okay. I mean, they all got some beef. Like this guy. Like this guy already. I'll be fine. He's gonna crush it. His strategy might not have changed, but he's definitely grown. Because he had that grudge against Hinata, and he went to bat for him. He could have just doubled down and used his influence and power in that position to create the world that he wants to see because of his own insecurities and fears. He could have just easily just slipped right into that circle of self-validation, closed-mindedness, in the most unchallenging way possible. And that just makes it so cool. And on top of that, Hinata now, instead of being an enemy, maybe is something like a chance for redemption for him. If he can mold Hinata into something that has a competitive chance of winning, that's his second chance in a sense. Never having had the opportunity as a player, he can have it as a coach. He can create it. That's fair. That's, I mean, it's, he stated that harshly, but Hinata has to prove himself. He's not going anywhere. He's gonna bike all the way here at the crack of dawn every day. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah, for sure. It's gonna be tough psychologically, physically, emotionally, but he's Hinata. He's gonna keep showing up. That actually sounds really great, just constantly watching yourself. It's hard, it's ego bruising, but... Damn. Oh, that's who it is, from the intro. He's an Olympic coach. He just looks like an Olympic coach. Introductions. Definitely made an entrance. <laughs> he says with pride. Oh, he's definitely gonna get his playtime. <laughs> oh, it's really cool to think that he and Suki are sharing this experience too. Proud of you, coach. Proud of you. Just for letting him out to get this far. It's still gonna be a sensitive spot. It's still gonna be a little raw. They let him in the door. MVP right here. Unveiling that flag or taking it out of the storage room and dusting it off was a real turning point for Karsuno. This is... It's only the first episode of this season, but this setup is pretty unreal. There's just so many things happening at once in parallel. I, it's so cool that Hinata just hijacked this training camp. I love it. Such a great twist. I was all busy feeling bad for him and then... But yeah, we got him and we got Kageyama, opportunity of a lifetime, or his, his childhood life, and then Karsuno doing their normal thing, preparing for nationals. So much potential. So many things that could happen. So much to learn. Is it just me or does it feel like this season will be Hinata's biggest struggle? You know, as hard as he's worked, as much pain as he's experienced and as hard as he's pushed himself, he's in new territory now. Like the coach mentioned, he has no Kakeyama. Karsuna's been super friendly to him, made him feel like he belonged. They're a great group of guys. Now he's an outcast, outsider. People are wary of him or just don't accept him based on his appearance. He's at a humiliating position compared to them. He's gonna eat that every day. And he's among some of the best of the best to currently play high school volleyball in Miyagi. It's the biggest test, but that also means some of the greatest opportunities for growth. Maybe one of the highest thresholds for reward for Hinata as a character. <laughs> 